I know that most people here in the room spend a lot of time thinking about giving and care about giving. And really the purpose of giving is uh, to create a change. What are the factors that really change the way that people behave and the way that they feel and what kind of factors uh, don't do much of a job? Data and figures are absolutely necessary and wonderful for finding out what the truth is. But on their own, they're not enough to persuade people of that truth. Stories, on the other hand, are quite powerful. So when we have emotion, part of the brain called the amygdala deep in our brain is activated and it sits right next to the hippocampus. The hippocampus is important for memory. And so when we are aroused, these two structures talk to each other and they create quite vivid memories. A study conducted by um, Dan Kahan from Yale University found that people who have better analytical and mathematical skills are more likely to twist data at will. People really encode information if it's coming from an agreeing partner. So what this means is that we should always start by establishing common ground. What we find in the lab is that people change their beliefs more when the information suggests the future can get better, rather information suggesting decline. The simple act of making a choice changes your preferences right, and makes you more motivated to the chosen option. And this only happens when people made the choice themselves. It is important to consider who is the person in front of us, what is their mental state. For example, if people are under stress, that really changes the way that our brain works. And it makes us more hypervigilant to negative information.